My name is Hayden Ton. I'm from Portland, Oregon. Ashley Sickles from Boise, Idaho. My name is Robert Elliott. Uh, originally from Houston, Texas. My name is Tobias Sherman Jr. and I am originally from Hollister, California. My name's Luke. I'm from Boise, Idaho. Scott Nitson from Boise. I'm Joel Fyan, I'm from Boise. Jessalyn Hamilton, Boise, Idaho. I can't believe it's been a year. It uh, I think one of the things that's been impressive with the, the premise of the Commons with the idea of this community and building a community, bringing over kind of the things that we had at Urban, the earlier place, but then uh, despite it being a pandemic and us being apart, I think somehow uh, the Commons has succeeded in preserving that and I've been thinking about that. Well, it means another year of great climate, I hope, and more people to see here. I've been seeing a lot of my classmates here lately. Commons turning one this month is actually pretty awesome because I started about this time uh, started climbing just after March, like closer to April. And so it actually like almost marks my year of climbing. It's so exciting. It means that we've had a full year of really supportive, cool community climbing. Um, a year of, of climbing that we didn't know if we would be able to have or not. I'm really excited that they've been able to survive COVID. Um, I remember when Clint first announced that they were going to start with this, this whole project and I was really excited. That means the success of a very special place to me. It's been a long time coming and um, it's finally here and we have this place to gather as a community. I'm happy that they're still here and I'm able to climb at this great gym. It's been a wild uh, year, uh, but the weather with grace, with commitment to strengthening community and with a lot of stoke. One thing I would like people to know about the Commons is I don't think um, I've ever been at another climbing gym that has supported students so much. It's got one of the most competitive and lowest prices for students. That it cultivates community and just the atmosphere that it provides is very unique. It's a great place to meet people and to, to make a group of friends and it's a great place to learn and get better at climbing. The one thing I want people to know about the Commons is it is a true community place to be. Um, you don't have to climb 512s, you don't have to be super competitive, it's a place to come and have fun. It has a bit of everything in the facility from lead climbing to top roping to bouldering to you have your own little workout facility area stretch and you have yoga as well, your own personal area for that. A bit of everything, it's a mix, and so it's really great about that, so you work all kind of areas of reclimbing if you're interested in that. I actually do feel, feel like part of this little Commons family. Granted, I've known several of them for a very long time, uh, but it is, it's kind of like coming home, and I appreciate that. It sounds kind of cliche, but everyone talks about, oh, you know, you get a community, but that's what they did here, and they, I would say that's the biggest selling point because it may sound silly, but even when Scott just says, oh, hey, how's it going? And as you're coming through the door or, you know, have a good night as you're leaving, it's, it's a different environment that I haven't experienced in other gyms before. It's a great community, you know? There's a lot of people that will cheer you on and, you know, help you get psyched because we're all psyched for the same thing, really, which is to climb. I mean, I've already told a lot of my friends about the Commons, but um, I, I would emphasize that they are a, a climbing, I mean, they're a climbing gym, but they're also a climbing home, and that they, they want to develop a climbing community. I will say that uh, over the past year, it's been great to see how much effort and outreach the Commons has done to get people who uh, are new to climbing or just want to check it out or um, haven't traditionally been featured in the sport um, into the gym and into the fold. So that has been super cool as well. So I climb to exercise my body and my mind. It's a way for me to, to get on a route and solve the puzzle. Climbing to me is this uh, taming or this little crucible of, uh, of, uh, of the battle in a sense that you do every day where you're kind of finding this edge of discomfort psychologically, physically, you're facing problems and problem solving and you're kind of doing this dance between uh, 
the, 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 the beauty of this movement and the fear that, that you meet at times in trying to determine if you can work through that fear and meet that fear and move through it. Uh, so it's like I, these days I try and climb till I at least fall once till I feel that little bit of fear and uh, kind of win that little mental battle. I've tried lots of sports and none of them coalesce in the trifecta of physical, psychological, and mental with route finding. So that, um, all of that coming together just really fills me right on up. I've actually used to do it on my own, which is really dangerous. So, and then one day I kind of figured I should probably start doing this with a partner. And that's what really led me to like, just like, I'm gonna climb and just bought some shoes and went for it. I climb just because it's so freeing in a way. It's the challenge. <laughs> uh, I, think, I think everyone's been on the wall and you know, you, you're maybe like three feet off the ground and you look down and you're like, oh, I can't let go. And I think it's that, just chasing that feeling of no, I can, I can keep going and I can keep doing this. So I really like climbing because it, um, it forces me to, to move my body, but also move my mind. I love puzzles. And I also really like it because I get to go places where I never would have gone. And I meet people that I never probably would have met. I've been climbing for 17 years now and I love the community around it. I love just getting out and exploring places, just the, the views and places that it, it gives you access to. One of the aspects of climbing that I enjoy so much is the downtime. Um, at least for me, I don't really do any other sports that has as much of a calm in between like routes or sets or what have you. So it's, it's, it's a sport that is more social, I think. And through that, I've just noticed such a supportive community um, just amongst all climbers of all levels. So it's, it's, it's really nice to be a part of the climbing community.